Very few people talk about nighttime lighting, and most 3D artists get it wrong. Because night scenes are not mostly lit by the sky, it totally depends on its environment. Let's move to some practical stuff and light this scene from the beginning. First, you have to figure out if there are any possible sources of lights in your scene. In my case, there can be some light from the house, so let's just add a point light and move it in the house. Don't just randomly put lights in the house. You can follow references if you want. You can use a black body node to add some color into the light, and you can use a texture to add a shape to the light. It is totally on you. The second thing is to add some fog. Add a big cube that covers your scene. Create a new material. Remove the principled node. Go under the volume tab and add the volume shader. Decrease the density and increase the anisotropy. Now this is where the magic comes in. If you add a blue tint and a small value to the emission of the volume shader, you will get something cool like this. You can push this all with the final moonlight. Add a point light, move it to the top so that it is not visible in the camera. Add some blue tint and increase the strength. And there you have it, perfect nighttime lighting and blender. You can also use the sky texture to create the background with stars. Uncheck sun, decrease the elevation and increase the altitude to 40,000. Decrease the strength to 0.05, add a mix shader and mix the noise texture with the sky texture with high scale and a color ramp. Mine are the best settings which will give you stars and the background. If you want to support the channel, check out the forest generator. You will also find all of the project files on my Patreon, including the free starter file for you to follow along.